Hi everybody, my name is Amber Carlson and this is my third year at Kendall College, which is now known as National Lewis University. I'm going to school to get my bachelor's degree in early childhood education with a concentration in ESL. Prior to this degree, I went to Rock Valley College and obtained my associates in arts. And five years ago, I started working as a paraeducator at our local school district. And I've been working in first grade, kindergarten, and now preschool. I love being able to help these little children learn and grow and taking these classes has helped me to help the teachers to find other strategies for helping the kids. So I hope that one day I can become a first grade teacher. Some of the, the question that I chose for this week is what are some of the best strategies for changing the position or views of others? I feel like there are many strategies that can be used to change the position or view of others and knowledge is one of them. If you have knowledge and facts to back up what you believe, people are more willing to listen to what you have to say and have an open mind about it. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., he had a lot of knowledge behind why he felt that desegregation was necessary. Socrates had a lot of knowledge behind why he felt that people should not maybe believe in the gods, but believe in something else. Um, these men had a lot of information and that is why they were able to change the views of others. Also, they had a lot of passion I feel like if you're passionate about something rather than pushing it on somebody, but simply by speaking to them passionately about why you feel the way you do, you're going to maybe have them think a little differently. Um, there are also risks that they had to take and taking risks is sometimes necessary for people to see what you believe and feel is true. Both of these men took risks and were being attacked but they continued anyways. They never backed down at one time. Every time Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. led a march, he was attacked or thrown into jail, but he continued to spread his beliefs. And I feel like because of that, he was able to change the views of others. So passion, determination, knowledge, taking risks, sometimes the combination of all of these are what can help change people's views.